Hey what's up guys, this is my video tutorial on how to install the official Android 4.3 Jelly Bean on your Galaxy Note 2 GT N7 100. So the Android 4.3 OTA update is rolling out for the Galaxy Note 2. It may take few days if the OTA update is not available in your region. If you are impatient and want to experience the Android 4.3, follow this tutorial. And uh, this tutorial is totally safe, will not void your warranty. This works with the International Galaxy Note 2 variant only, that is the GT N7100. Right now, I'm on a custom ROM. It does not matter whatever ROM you are using or firmware you are on. Most probably, you will not be losing your apps and your data, but in case if you get stuck on the boot loop after installing this firmware, you need to do a factory reset. So I will get back to this in the end of this video. So first thing first, Hit link 1 and 2 from the description, download Samsung keys and PC Odin, install it, once done, hit link 3 from the description, get the official firmware file, download it, and once done, it's the PC part. So here we have the ROM file, the Samsung keys and the PC Odin. So first uh, let me just quickly create a folder, rename it to 4.3 and uh, transfer this zip file into the folder so that it will be easier to extract. Extract it. So here you have this .tar.md5 file. Once you have this, on your phone hold the down volume, power and the home button at the same time to get into the download mode. Keep holding it till you get into it. So you can let go the keys once you see this and now connect the phone to your PC via the USB cable. Once done, hit the volume up to continue mm -hmm. and leave your phone as it is. Now open PC Odin, yes and uh, here you must see this tab, the IDCOM tab turned into blue. If you don't have this blue, that means your drivers are not installed properly. Try reinstalling the Samsung keys, that will fix this issue. And once you have this blue, leave the rest of the settings as it is. Go on to PDA and uh, navigate to wherever you have the .tar.md5 file. And select it, hit open and hit start. And wait for the installation to complete. So once it says pass, you can just unplug your phone from your PC. So guys, in case if you get stuck here on the boot loop, what you can do is you can just unplug the battery, plug it in, hold the up volume, power and the home button at the same time get into the system recovery, do a wipe data factory reset and again get into the download mode and follow the same procedure as you have flashed this firmware. So that will fix the boot loop issue. So guys we are up here. So let me just go on to settings. More about device and uh, this is the Android 4.3 Jelly Bean. So that wraps up this video guys. I will be doing a review on what's new with the official Android 4.3 for the Galaxy Note 2. Stay tuned for more tech videos and you guys have a great day. Bye bye now.